Hey y'all, I am Christina Louise and I am back with another TV Stuff review. Today I'm going to be reviewing the Calming Comfort Cooling Knee Pillow by Sharper Image. Goodness, this is a pain. And I almost tripped over it actually. That was a pain in my butt. Those are two negatives. Like we saw on the couch, it just says, you know, really just move it along any part that it's comfortable for you. I kind of feel like that's the only spot for me. Otherwise, these little notches that kind of bulk out are just uncomfortable in how they wrap around my leg. All right, there we go. Now we're getting it. Okay, so it's time to tell you guys what I thought overall about this cooling leg pillow. Today, I'm going to be reviewing the Cooling Knee Pillow by Sharper Image. So this is the same company that did the weighted blanket that I reviewed not too long ago. And this product is actually really similar to the Contour Legacy Leg Pillow that I reviewed not too long ago. It was a little bit different in shape. That one was a little bit of a teardrop shape, if you will. And this just looks like your standard leg pillow or knee pillow, if you will. Oh, let's actually compare the sizes. So it's definitely taller. Some parts of it are definitely wider in size. Just to get a feel for the difference. Even just holding them right now, this one, I can feel that it's noticeably cooler to the touch right now and even on my leg. So just a quick little comparison to show y'all the size difference and even just the design difference in these two pillows. But we'll put that one to the side for now. We're going to focus on this one. Um, however, the fabric is polyester and spandex. It feels very nice, a little like silky smooth. Open up the zipper. You have that memory foam there and also you have some cooling gels. So that is going to be that cooling feature, something that that other pillow did not have. So I'm definitely excited to try this one. I'm really hoping that I'll be able to tell the difference. I will say just touching it and like holding this pillow right now, I can already feel that cooling aspect. So I'm excited to try it out for a few nights, sleep with it. Hopefully I can keep this one. If you remember correctly, um, that other one, I just, when I was sleeping with it, I, I couldn't keep it in between my knees. I couldn't keep it in the bed. I was constantly losing it. So maybe with this one being cooling and a different design, maybe it will be more comfortable and we'll have better luck. So I'm going to try it out for a couple nights, lounge around a little bit with it. Um, I might even let my little girl try it out. She always loves trying everything as well and heck, can say the darndest thing, so we never know what she's going to say. Um, so I'm excited to try it out. I will definitely be back and I will let you guys know everything that I thought about it, but be sure to subscribe and click the bell in the corner so you get notifications each time that we post a new video and be sure to stay tuned for the rest of this review. Oh, that's a little big. I'm not sure if I'm going to like that. It seems a little bait, like a little bulky. I'm feeling like that's not making my spine in alignment. If that's making any sense, I feel like my legs are still too far apart as if they can't come close together enough but maybe as I just sit here my natural body weight will kind of weigh it down I guess we'll see it also says to just kind of play with it to see you know where you like it best um, the design definitely makes it a little difficult <laughs> to play with it and sort of move it around to different areas so I don't know we'll put it right there seems to be the easiest place for this little up there in the back just like this one to kind of wrap around my leg so I'm just going to lay here and catch up on I believe I have two episodes of the voice so I'm gonna be here for about two hours <laughs> before I have to go get my daughter and I'm just gonna use this cooling leg pillow and I will say even just right now laying here I can feel that cooling effect so that's really comfy if they would make like a regular pillow like that oh my gosh I'd be all over that because that is a nice little feature just being able to feel that I definitely did not feel that on that contour legacy leg pillow so so far this one is definitely winning in that department when it comes to that feature 
So I'm just gonna watch my episodes and later on I'll take this thing to bed and I'll be back later on to let you guys know what I think of it just lounging and how I slept with it, if I was able to keep it with me through the night or whether I lost it just like the last one. All right, y'all, so I am gonna go to bed. I'm going to sleep with the cooling knee pillow tonight by Calming Comfort. Um, and I will let you guys know what I think. So, like we saw on the couch, it just says, you know, really just move it along any part that it's comfortable for you. I kind of feel like that's the only spot for me. Otherwise, these little notches that kind of bulk out are just uncomfortable and how they wrap around my leg. It's either, you know, on my calf or something like that. It just feels like it doesn't work anywhere. <laughs> but here, again, it could be because I'm super short. Maybe my legs aren't long enough. I don't have enough space to kind of move it around. It could, again, be because I'm petite. It could just be user error. Who knows? Um, but again, I do definitely like that cooling feature that I can feel right now. I am the person that I like it to be a little cool in the room at night while I sleep, but I still definitely need to have a blanket on me, so this will definitely come in handy. So I'm going to go to bed, and I will be back in the morning, and I'll let you guys know what I thought about it. All right, y'all. So last night, I slept with the Calming Comfort cooling knee pillow by Sharper Image. Um, gotta tell you, I lost it. <laughs> um, I mean, I know that I was in between my legs by my knees um, while I was watching a movie before I fell asleep, um, but every time I woke up in the middle of the night, which was about three or four times last night, um, it was gone. <laughs> Two times it was actually on the floor. It wasn't even in the bed anymore. So as I was feeling around and I couldn't find it, um, I got up to use the bathroom and I was tripped over it actually because it was on the floor. Um, again, I like the cooling feature, so maybe just a little bit smaller design or I don't know, make it make it a big pillow, make it a head pillow. I would sleep with that under my head. I would put that between my knees or my legs. I would do, I mean, I would totally use that, but this, I don't know, again, if it's just my size <laughs> or if it's the size of the pillow, but I lost it and I didn't really get to sleep very long with it. So <laughs> I'm not sure if I'm gonna feel any benefits in my lower back from Maybe the 45 minutes that I was awake and it was still in between my knees while I watched a movie. But I'm going to try it again tonight and maybe even a third night just to see. I mean, that little insert did say to give it a few nights. Not only to adjust to the pillow um, itself and, you know, your body's molding to it, but also just getting used to that position, sleeping on your side. As I said, I do sleep on my side, but I'm the person that, like... I'm not just like this all night long. I kind of roll. <laughs> so it's like a side stomach position that I'm on. So it could just be the positioning. I'm not sure, but I'll give it a shot again tonight and probably the next night. And I'll be back to let you guys know what I thought overall. So now that I've lounged around with it and I even slept with it a couple nights, I'm just going to take this case off and throw it in the washing machine. It does say that you can machine wash it on cold. Um, and do not dry the case. Um, it says do not dry and do not iron. Oh, goodness, this is a pain. I can't, I can't imagine trying to get it back in here. Okay, let's see. <laughs> I don't want to rip the case or damage the pillow. It would have been nice if the zipper wrapped around one of the sides because that's really hard to get off and really scares me and makes me wonder if I'm going to be able to get this back on there. I mean, that opening that it allowed you on the side is barely wide enough. I don't know if you can see to even get it past these wider parts on the outside. I mean, it's literally, I'm having to squeeze. I'm glad it's memory foam <laughs> because otherwise this pillow would not be coming out of here. Okay. Got it. So this is what the pillow looks like on the inside. You got the memory foam with those gel pieces on there, which are definitely comfortable. Um, I did like it when I was just laying on the couch and I did like it at night. Um, so we're gonna go ahead and I'm just going to throw this in the washing machine and then just hang it up to dry for a little bit and then try to get this pillow back in there. We'll see. Okay, so I have 
washed the case. Um, I just hung it in the bathroom over the towel rack to dry. Um, looks like it did fine. Um, nothing's ripped. I think I did that when I was taking the pillow out. But let's try to get it back in here. So this zipper is supposed to go across one of these longer sides. And I remember finally getting it out in this direction. So that's how I'm going to start. <laughs> digging those cooling gels there on the sides of the pillow. But you have to stay tuned if you want to hear all my thoughts. Okay, so it's time to tell you guys what I thought overall about this cooling leg pillow. I think it's a little too bulky for me. Maybe it's just because I'm a little petite. Maybe it's because I'm a girl. I don't know, maybe it's in my head, but I just felt like it was a little too big, a little too bulky. Um, it did get a little bit better as I laid here with it. My natural body weight did compress the pillow a little bit more. Um, it got a little bit better, but I still feel like it's just, it's just too big. Um, I did sleep with it for, I think, three nights. I think I used it three nights. Um, I lost it every night. <laughs> um, it was kind of uncomfortable. It's fine at first because it's a new position and I'm just kind of cozy and snug and happy to be in bed, but after too long I don't know if it was just that new position of staying right there on my side and not sort of rolling over a little bit more that was uncomfortable or difficult to stay in, but it was just a little hard for me. I did lose it as I said. Um, it actually fell out of the bed a couple times over those three nights too. Um, which doesn't happen when I just have a standard, you know, head pillow between my legs. I can't remember the last time that I lost that pillow in the middle of the night. It is always there. But this and that other pillow that I reviewed before, just constantly using, losing them in the middle of the night. It might be the size. It might just be because of the position that I need to sleep in in them. Um, but I did like the cooling effect. So like I said before, if they made a head pillow with this cooling gel stuff on it, that would be fantastic. I would be all over trying that pillow because I really did like that. You can definitely feel it even just sitting here holding it right now when I lounged on the couch, when I took it to bed. Although it was a little bulky, that is one thing that I liked about it. So I'm going to give the cooling leg pillow two out of five stars. Stay tuned for next time with me, Christina Louise. Thank you so much. 